Hey everybody, Jeanette Womble here in Columbia, South Carolina. I am here with my client and friend Ruth in her beautiful home to share her story with you today about our experience working together to find your amazing home here. So let's go back to how we met each other. So when did we meet? We met last summer, mm -hmm. a year. So we've been a year. Yeah, a year, yeah. Mm -hmm. And we met, yeah. and we met at an open open house. Mm -hmm. And I remember after we met, you said you might be coming to the area. Um, you weren't quite sure if you were going to be coming then or if you were going to wait. And then some time went by, and you reached out to me, and you said, "Guess what? I'm coming." Yes. Now, and then, and then I think you actually said, "Do you remember me?" Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and I did remember, mm -hmm. and I was so excited that you reached out again when you're ready for your search. So we were looking for what maybe the past four months or so, would you say, for your house? Since um, April. April. Okay. So yeah, about three four months. Um, how would you explain the process right now of looking for homes in Columbia? What was your experience like? Uh, well, I, there's a lot in, involved, but mainly um, you have to be ready, mm -hmm. I think, is the main thing. Mm -hmm. You can't really um, dilly-dally around. You have to make a decision. Make a decision quickly. Because yeah, make a quick decision. even though the rates are higher, mm -hmm. houses are still selling very quickly in our area because there just isn't a lot of supply right now. So we still we don't get the chance to go two or three times to make a decision. You really have to go through, decide if you like it or not. And I know a few of the ones that we looked at, I would even call you and say, well, they've got multiple offers. And you know, the hope is that you could do some negotiation, mm -hmm. but in some cases, you know, we really didn't have an opportunity to do that. So, you know, when we found the one that we're here now, um, we were fortunate enough to be able to negotiate a little bit. That was great, uh, the way that worked out. Mm -hmm. It worked out really well, and it's such a beautiful home. So, since you've closed, you've moved in, you've repainted, you've put new flooring in, um, it looks like an absolute show place. So, I'm really happy to see everything that you've done. If somebody is thinking about coming to our area, I know you relocated from the Northeast. Yes. Um, what advice would you have for them and what would you share with them about working with me if they wanted me to help them with their home purchase process? Well, I think everything for me went very well because everything fell into place. And I think that if I had to do over again, I think I might have focused on selling my home first Mm -hmm. and putting the money in the bank and then starting to look. Mm -hmm. And why would you why would you do that? Like what makes you go there as far as, you know, thinking that that might have been better? Um, Maybe just say so you would have the the cash ready so you could do offers without a home sale contingency. Well, you know, I think a lot about buying real estate is just how the cards land on the table. Yes. There's like no, like you don't know what's going to happen. No, every so, day it changes. Yeah, every day it changes. Yeah, it does. It does. It yeah. does. Mm -hmm. Well, I, I can tell you that, you know, the perfect position to be in, mm -hmm. as you mentioned, is to have your current home sold, mm -hmm. especially if you do want to use any of the proceeds to buy your next. Because when you do those offers and they're not resting on a home sale contingency, yeah. it gives you a stronger position when you make your offer. Yeah, and I was fortunate that things worked out the way they did for me to buy this house. You definitely were. And, you know, we talked about this a few times as mm -hmm. we were going through the process that sometimes you just rest on if it's meant to be, it's going to happen. Mm -hmm. And, you know, we both kind of shared that belief system. And I think it gave us a little bit of uh, a lower stress mindset as we were going through, hoping that all the stars were going to align. Yeah. And they really did. And they did, yeah. And, and, and it, it felt like I was throwing all my cards up in the air and it was yes. like, okay, we're going to land somewhere. <laughs> they are. And, you yeah. know, it's so nice now that you can be near your family. Mm -hmm. You've got such a lovely family. And I'm so happy that you're here. And, you know, now we can say we're friends. Yes. She was my realtor, but now she's my friend. Yes. And yeah. we just get to mm -hmm. enjoy having you here. Mm -hmm. So um, I really appreciate you taking the time to share your story. And if you're looking to move to the area, especially if you're trying to move from out of our area um, and you'd like to learn more about Columbia and what, what we have to offer here, uh, please feel free to give me a call or reach out and I'd be happy to help you with your relocation. Um, I really appreciate you taking the time to share 
quick. Everything yeah, I'd like to tell everybody uh, what a great resource you are. You're a phenomenal resource. You've helped me with every step of the way. And I relied on you a lot for advice. And the advice was always dead on. Sorry, I got She's live. <laughs> I know the point. Welcome to, to the South. We have lives. <laughs> well, I appreciate that. I try really hard to um, to kind of just treat your steps as if I was walking on your path and giving you, you know, the advice that I would want to hear if I was going to help me with everything. I mean, I couldn't get over it. I I just never had that kind of assistance from a realtor before. Mm -hmm. And you know, you knew so much, you have so much, you have a background of information. A little bit of experience, yeah. right? A lot, a lot. <laughs> so I'm so thankful to work with you. Well, I was Thank grateful you. as well, and I still am. And I want you to know that as you get settled, if there are things that I can help you with or um, assist you with, you know, why, now that you're here, you know, it's not just helping you find your home and get settled in, but if you need anything else after the fact, I'm definitely here. And that's one thing that I love to do for my clients is just be there not only for the process, but also after the process as yes, well. Yes, you do. You have a very personal approach, and I love it. And I've come to love you very much. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Now you're going to make me cry. <laughs> <laughs> well, everybody, thanks for watching and listening to our story. And again, if I can help you with your real estate goals here in Columbia, South Carolina, or the area, uh, please uh, feel free to reach out to me. So I appreciate you watching and I hope you're having a great day.